Hello Gracians, I'm so delighted that you can join me today. I am Brother Rich of Grace Filipino Ministry. Welcome to Grace Every Morning. Today, let us reflect on Psalms chapter 7. My devotional thought for Psalm 7 is entitled, Come Here and Hide. Do you love crabs? You know, as in chili crab? I do. We all love the tasty crab meat. But before getting to the good stuff, one must carefully negotiate the hard shell and sharp spines. The crab is one tough marine creature. But did you know that there are phases in a crab's life when it needs to shed off its hard shell and grow a new one? The new shell is soft and will need time to harden. During this time, the crab is practically defenseless from predators. So immediately after shedding the hard shell, it must quickly find the nearest crack or crevice to hide in. There, the crab in its vulnerable state hides protected from its pursuers. Psalms chapter 7 verse 1 reads, I come to you for protection, O Lord my God. Save me from my persecutors. Rescue me. God anointed David as the new king of Israel, but Saul did not want to let go of the throne. Instead, he wanted David dead. So David fled for his life. Nobody to turn to. David knew that if he is caught, Saul's minions will tear him up like a lion tears up its prey. In a psalm of desperation, he cried out to God. David did not deny the reality of his perilous circumstance, and he is cognizant of his vulnerabilities. Yet, he also knew all too well that he can run to God for protection and remain safely in his presence. Back in my childhood days, my friends and I would play hide-and-seek on moonlit, moonlit nights. Being the youngest in the troop, I was so stressed out and anxious when my older friends find their own hiding spots, but I couldn't find one for myself. I would ask them if I could come to their spots to hide, but all I got was a no, go away reply. I thought to myself, surely the pursuer will find me and outrun me to the base. I will be the it for the rest of the night. I felt helpless and desperate until I heard an older friend called out to me in a hushed voice, Hey, come here and hide. What a relief. It was just a childhood game, but it gives us a hint of how helpless and desperate we can feel when we are being pursued and there's no place to hide. And how those anxious feelings are replaced by a sense of security when we finally find a safe haven. In the same way, every time we come to God with our worries and fears, we receive His assurance that everything will be all right and that we can always come and hide in the security of His presence. We may face tough situations that will expose our weakness and magnify our inadequacies. Certain circumstances can make us realize that we cannot take refuge behind our checkbooks or find real peace in the company of friends and associates. Confronted by pursuers from all sides and nowhere to hide, we feel anxious, helpless, and desperate. But take heart, Yahweh is our refuge. He is our hiding place. Our Father knows our frame and He remembers that we are dust. He invites us to seek shelter in Him. So let us come to our Almighty God for protection, healing, and true security. Let us now sing the song, You Are My Hiding Place. May we be reminded that God is our hiding place, that whenever we are afraid, we can always come to Him and trust Him to keep us safe. You are my hiding place You always fill my heart With songs of deliverance Whenever I am afraid I will trust in you 
I will trust in you Let the weak say I am strong in the strength of my Lord You are my hiding place You always fill my heart with songs of Deliverance Whenever I am afraid I will trust in you Let us pray Father, thank you that we can come to you anytime We may face troubles from all sides, but we can always rest in your presence and take refuge in your love and perfect peace. As we go about our days, Lord, we pray that you will always keep us hidden in the righteousness and grace of your Son, Jesus Christ. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Thank you for joining me today. We look forward to seeing you again at Grace Every Morning. Have a blessed day ahead.